Hello, lords and ladies. This is Arc Hit King. <clears throat> As you can tell by that uh, intro movie, we will be playing Chaotic Shadow Warriors today. Now, this is a title I've always wanted to play for <clears throat> several years since the show came out. And sadly, the show's been cancelled or it's finished. <clears throat> but I really wanted to play this. It's gotten, it's gotten bad reviews, but I still want to give it a go. So if, you know, this video gets enough uh, likes and support, I'll make an LP out of it. So uh, let's not watch this again. Anyways, like I was saying, if we can get enough likes, five likes is what I've been asking for, uh, then this will be uh, another LP that I'll be doing during the month of September, which is the time I'm recording this. It is a short game, so... It shouldn't uh, take any time at all, and we'll, you know, it won't take away from next month, which will be fully devoted to only two LPs that I'm positive about, which is Pokemon Y and uh, Beyond Two Souls. And maybe another LP, but I'm not quite positive. Uh, as long as I get one of those LPs finished, then maybe I might start another one. Anyways, enough, enough of me talking. Let's uh, hit new game and start this. Create a new save. All right. All right. So we got story, multiplayer. We don't have access to army editor. We got portal to perm, perm. I don't know why I said perm. Options. Yeah, let's check out that. Controls, movement, gameplay. Auto save is on. Display tutorial messages. Sure. Um, audio, effects, movies, yes I do want to keep the sentence, and it doesn't look like there is anything about, uh, okay, I guess we can save again, there isn't anything about, um, Subtitles. Oh man, it took me so long to think of what I was trying to say. Anyways, uh, we don't have anyone to play multiplayer with, so let's start the story. Right. Major Tom, welcome back to Param. I am the automated assistant included with your new scanner. I will chime in any time you meet things you might not remember well or that are new to you. Whenever you feel confident enough, you can disable this context help by setting the tutorial option to off in the gameplay options menu. Oh boy, this might get annoying. All right, L to move, that's basic. Right analog stick. <clears throat> Sounds good to me. Yeah, like I thought. Uh, wait, what does L2 do? Whoa, that was weird. L2 looks like another way to look around, I guess. Hold on, let me... This is your scanner. <laughs> Here, you can control the setup of your hologram creatures in the army editor. View the portal to Param. Containing valuable information about creatures, battle gear, and music. See current and completed tasks. Check the logbook for information. And when available, you can select the port option, which allows you to quickly move between locations you have already visited. Uh. That wasn't exactly what I needed. Yeah, I'm definitely... Okay. Wait, I feel like they didn't change. Hold on. Okay, never mind. 
All right, that's a bit better. All right, so there's a cat guy. I'm busy. Too busy to check out this new scanner that the Codemasters asked me to test out for them? It projects these holograms that look just like the real thing. I said I'm busy. And holds tons more scans than a normal scanner can. Hey, maybe I could help you. How? Can a human defeat an entire commando of thieves? What thieves? The thieves who stole battle gear from the overworld arsenal. I've tracked them this far and I won't let them escape. But who would do something like that? Mepidians, that's who. Have you seen any? No, but I could help you look for them. And maybe get a Mepedian scan or two at the same time. Well, okay. If you see or hear anything, call me. Okay, I'll go this way. Whenever you feel lost, hold the path indicator button, and you'll be pointed in the right direction. Oh, that's what it is. Like, if I turned around, it would point me in the opposite direction. I got it, I got it, I got it. There are many things worth collecting, and some are well concealed. The collectible detector will become opaque when any of them are nearby. Okay. So when that thing gets darker, that's when things are nearby. Very, and the camera's kind of weird, which is a complaint I heard about, or read about technically, but whatever. Uh, I think it's getting a little bit dark. So we gotta go that way. Let's check out this way, though. See if there's anything worth finding. Like this. Scan it. Alright, item found. Aspect Amplifier Agility. Equipped creature gains outperform. Five speed attack. Speed attack, still five. Oh. I didn't read that fast enough. Oh my god, look at his jump. Like, look at it. Look at his jump. It's so wimpy. Though, I guess you can kind of expect that. He's a human. And it's not exactly like he's an action hero. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, it's getting darker again. Yeah, because this is the path I was supposed to go. Uh. Ah! It's down here. Alright. Except... Hey, I found a secret area! Um, now what? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I didn't see that before. Item found, Cascada Symphony, until the end of the turn, damage dealt by water and fire, I guess? Attacks to target creatures reduced by five. And I also found Decrescendo, deal five damage to target creatures. Awesome. I don't remember what the symbols mean. It has been a while since I watched a show. I really do hate it when they use symbols and I have no idea what they mean. Alright, gotta go that way. But, there could be secrets this way. Watch out for insects and other small hostile param inhabitants. You stay out of their way unless you're well equipped for dealing with them. Okay. Oh god! You have ported out of danger. Okay, I guess that means not to go that way. Alright, alright. Whatever game, we'll go this way then. Whoa, this is a giant log. Oh, actually, it's a tree, but... Yeah, look at the camera angle. Like, I just touch it left. It's, like, really wonky. So, if you get really motion sickness... If you get motion sick or whatever... I apologize. Uh... I'm guessing this is what I was looking for? A stolen crate. I found the stolen battle gear! Or at least what's left of it. Those bastard Mepedians must have escaped with the rest. I need you to find Dractal and tell him about this. You can count on me. Don't tell me what to do. Okay, well, I guess you can tell me. Objective completed rewards. Uh, new skin acquired. Atticat. A ferocious warrior. When he finally gets up the nerve to battle. Um, battle gear. Elixir of tenacity. Equipped creature gains something 10 and something 10. <laughs> if you equip creatures has at least 50, I'm guessing, energy. It gains 10 in there? Okay, whatever. A pyro blaster. The Pyro Blaster is, the closest I've ever got to one. is an effective must have dropped it. defense against various critters throughout Param. Oh, so I can shoot that. Is there something else nearby? I'm guessing so. Ah, yeah. Right here. And I can climb. Song of Re Resurgence. Heal 20 energy to target creature. Alright, sweet. 
Uh, now, this isn't just about exploration, and that you won't just be playing as... Uh, crap, forgot his name. Maybe I should have looked all this up before I started. Anyways, uh, you'll also be able to battle as your creatures. What's this? Alright, more ammo for a gun that I don't know how to use, because they haven't taught me how to use it yet. And I'm not even sure I do use it. Alright, I'm guessing they're going to teach me how in a minute. As we collect more of this. Okay, you can now use the Power Blaster to help defend yourself. Press R2 to fire, holding R2 supercharges the Power Blaster, and then release the powerful blast stun more foes. Alright, I just had to get used to it. Oh man, I thought I shot him. All right, let, let me try that again. All right, oh, there's more. Well, that was the same creature. All right, I waste a lot of ammo on that. Oh, what? Do they regenerate? Oh yes, they do. Oh, damn it. Wow, I'm already sucking at this game. <laughs> oh god, they do regenerate. Stay away. Uh, is there more ammo I can find? Uh, let me go collect some. Alright, never mind. I got a good, good bit. Alright, I gotta fire that better. Alright, let's try that again. Ah! All right, let's run. Because apparently they re uh, they re they respawn. Oh God! Your scanner projects solid holograms of the creatures and battle gear you've collected. Before going into battle, you need to choose the creatures, layout, and equipment of your hologram army. Each slot shows the creature occupying it and its equipped battle gear. Select the Atacat scan in the front row. Oh, see, now this is different than in the show. In the show, uh, the humans were pretty helpless uh, unless they had, you know, their uh, monster friends with them and they couldn't actually battle. But in the game, they decided to introduce uh, hard holograms or whatever so that you can battle anywhere. Okay, select the Atacat scan in the front row. Here, you can choose the creature you want to place in the selected slot. You have only scanned Atacat so far. Let's take a minute to look at the various attributes of a creature, as they are extremely important. First, the creature's disciplines. Courage indicates how brave the creature is. Power shows its strength. Wisdom reveals how intelligent it is. And speed, how fast. The elements indicate what type of elemental attacks this creature can perform. You'll need music counters to cast music. This number shows how many music counters each creature brings to your army. The strength of a creature's attacks can be greatly influenced by its attributes. The attributes affecting the damage dealt by an attack are displayed next to the attack's name. The tribe affiliation icon indicates the tribe that the creature belongs to. Some creatures cannot enter mixed armies. Here you can browse multiple scans of the same creature you've acquired. Each scan is a unique snapshot of that creature, containing the stats at the time the scan was completed. The level of a scan greatly influences the rest of its attributes. Higher level scans feature more attacks that can also deal more damage. Energy, the hologram's life, perhaps the most important attribute is also displayed in this section. Here, you can choose the battle gear for your creature. The pulsating attributes show you how the battle gear you've chosen is affecting your creature's attributes. All right, that was a lot of information and I remember it. There was also a card game about this, not to go too off topic. Um, yeah, we only have Atticat. All right, so can select what we want to use. All right, okay, um, quick creature gains outperform. Um, five, okay, speed attacks deal five more damage. 
Uh, Quip Creatures gains Courage, 10. And, oh, okay, I see what they're... Okay, it's, this one doesn't really look like it changes anything. Okay, I think we're going to go with Elixir of Tenacity. Because, you know, Courage goes up by 10. Uh, speed goes up by 10. If a Quip Creature uh, has at least 50... Um, power, it gains 10 energy. So, this is good. Well, I think we'll go with this one instead. Alright. Uh, battle. During the battles, armies take turns attacking each other. Notice the attributes of your currently selected creature. It's energy, disciplines, elements, level, and equipped battle gear. Creatures can perform one of four actions per turn. Attack, Ability, Music, and Taunt. Select Attack. Alright, cool. it's kind of like Pokemon. <laughs> but, uh, not really Pokemon. Because uh, any RPG usually has these kind of elements. Attacks are the main means for destroying your opponents. Higher level creatures have more attacks. The target creature stats are displayed side by side with your creatures. Scroll down and highlight Velocitrap. All right. Okay, so these are our moves, and it won't let me go back Depending up. Depending on the values of certain attributes of your creature, or the way they compare to the target creatures, your attacks can deal more damage. Battle gear, abilities, music, and taunts can all alter the attributes of your creature thus changing the amount of damage dealt by your attacks. You can display more information about the currently engaged creatures. Do this now. All right, we gotta hold the triangle button to do this. You can view details about the battle gear that each creature is using, and you can also see what effects are currently active on both creatures. Let's switch back to the simple display. All right. To initiate an attack, you need sufficient action points, or AP. Some attacks consume action points, while others replenish them. The number of AP associated with the attack is displayed next to the attack name, followed by the available AP that creature currently possesses. Initiate Velocitrap. All right, so we have seven AP available, and Velocitrap is going to take three out of seven. All right, and it deals 10 damage, so that's pretty good for now, I guess. Each attack has a sequence of prompts that, if performed right, will increase its damage or replenish your creature's AP. Perform the indicated action. God, mini games. The prompts slide over their target area. Let's practice this a bit. Okay. Good. Now do this against your opponent. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha. Mini games. Not good at them. Sorry for the run around. Alright. Excellent hit. Right. During the opponent's attacks, you have two actions at your disposal. You can try to block the attack or scan the attacking creature. Let's practice both. Engage blocking. Alright, R2 to hold R2. The blocking meter. Oh, we gotta shake the controller. Excellent. Now. Engage scanning. To scan an opponent creature, track the moving disc as closely as possible. Acquiring a complete scan of a creature will make it available for use in future battles. Try to get the scan up to 50%. Ah, uh, wonky controls. Wonky controls. Perfect. Remember, you can either scan or block. Never both at the same time. You can alternate between them for the duration of the opponent's attack, though. Now, apply this against your opponent. Okay, so we can see that we can either choose to block or scan it. Blocking, of course, is going to be perfect for not getting our butts kicked, but scanning means we can get the opponent. So. This should fit you. Echo Spasm! I don't think I got it. What do you think? Do you think I got it? I don't know. All right, let's go with. Let's go with this again. Sorry for the run around. Run 
All right, we uh, dealt 11 energy. We didn't do so well that time. The, the controls are pretty wonky. Like, you have to, like, move the controller so that you can actually hit them. Alright. Alright, I think we killed him. <laughs> did we? But did we ever even manage to scan him? Battle statistics. No new creature. Damn it! I mean, dar darn it. I'm sorry. We didn't get it. This is going to make it where it seems like I'm going to have a difficult time actually capturing, uh, or rather scanning creatures. Because I either have to block or I have to scan them. And scanning is, like, really involved. I would rather it be, like, like a button presses or something, rather than me having to uh, maneuver my PS3 controller. If I had, like, the PlayStation Move thing, this might be simpler. I mean, it's, this is no Wii. If I had a Wii remote, this would have been simpler. But, yeah, I actually have to move the... Whatever, it's difficult. Whoa, what was that? Lepedians don't just disappear when you beat them. New, okay, objective complete, rewarded. New slot available in army. Uh, music fragments. Uh, we got two day crescendos, and they, of course, deal five damage. All right. Let's keep moving. Looks like we're coming upon something important. Is it... Yes. All right. Found something. Scanning it. Alright, we got Aspect, Amplifier, Bravery, Equip, Creature, Gains, Outperform, Bravery, plus 5, uh, Courage, Attack, Steal, 5 more damage. Alright, close. Is there something still over here? Let me look. Doesn't look like there's anything else I can do over here. Okay, let's go back across. Okay, we're headed this way. Oh, crap, enemies. Oh, Song of Resurgence, heal 20 energy to target creature. All right, that was some music I believe we got. What's this? I've been looking for you. Batacat found the thief's trail. But watch out, the Mopedians I've run into are acting weird. Okay, oh, new scan, Dractyl, the high flying overworld messenger and spy. Got uh, battle gear, two times aqua shield, equip creature gains five energy, sacrifice aqua shield to heal 15 energy. All right. Okay, we're going that way, but it looks like we can not go that way. Okay, never mind. I thought if we could crouch the encounter. I don't know what that means. Oh, enemies. Building a larger army increases your chances of victory. Place Dractyl next to Atacat before starting the battle. All right, Mr. Voice inside Let's my head. Also equip Dractyl with battle gear. Select Aqua Shield. The Aqua Shield augments Dractyl's energy and also gives him a one time healing ability. Alright, time to battle then. Arena Force of Life, Initiative Wisdom. Okay, that means they attack. Get ready to meet your doom. Okay, I got. I got part of his. I, I scanned part of them. Alright. Let's do a basic attack instead. So I want to scan him. Alright. Did not get him that time. Right. Do I have an ability? No, I do not want to sacrifice that. Never mind. Uh, do you have any music? No, you do not. Okay. Let's attack then. Okay, we'll go with Ecto thingy. Alright, we're we're actually doing pretty good. This will rock your world. Alright, we got more of him. Okay. We've almost got scans of uh, 
both of them, I think. Sorry for the run around. Blood and trash. Oh, did we kill him? No. Okay, good. We can still scan him then. Okay, we only scanned 60% of him. Left. Oh, man. Okay, he's down. We didn't get him, I don't think. Yes! 100%. Ah, we had time to block and we didn't. Alright, let's just go full out on this guy then. Let's finish him off. And I think that should have done it. Nope, he's still standing. All right then. This will start my winning streak. Shake, 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 shake. All right. We're doing good. Where's my other guy? Is he gone? Did he die? I don't remember when he died. Oh, I think he was battling the other guy then. Um, how much health does he have left? Uh. 27. Oh, we need to do better than that. We, I don't have enough for that. Um. Alright, it's kind of hard to do the motion controls because I'm several feet away from my... Block, block, block. I've already scanned him, so... Uh... Thing is, we're running out of eight. Oh no, we got enough AP again. Sorry for the run around. Oh man, I missed it. I thought we got it. Uh, come on, let's scan him, scan him. Oh, he did. I, I was like, well, we can't block that because it was music. We can't block music, and that wasn't really an attack on us. So Sorry for the run around. Alright. Please kill him. Darn it. This will start my winning shriek. Shriek shriek. Yeah, okay, we got hundred percent, but we didn't have enough time to block that time. So we we did get him. Though I think I thought we already had him. Okay, we don't have enough for that. Uh uh. Darn it. He has 12 left. We have 15 left. We can scan him again. Didn't have enough time. Oh, damn it. We're going to lose this one. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, what does this do? Uh, let's try it. This will start my winning streak. Ah, uh, didn't have enough. Oh man, this doesn't look good. Decrescendo. Oh no. Guys, I don't think we're gonna win this one. Okay, this might be it. Okay, he still has... Okay, that was a good hit. That was a good hit. Okay, block, block, block. Oh, God. We're down to the wire here, guys. Did we get him? Yes. That was a tough one. Made me actually work for it. Battle statistics. Mm, awesome. Uh, we also got two of, uh, I think, Quakey. He's a Mepedian. New slot available in army. Two spectral viewers. equipped creatures immune to all invisibility abilities. Um, all right. That's good. Okay, we got good stuff. You have acquired a creature scan that can bring music counters to your army. Use it in your next battle. All right. Anyways, guys, actually, that's going to be it for this first video. 
Um, if you guys liked it, if you thought this was interesting, and if you would very much like to see the continuation of this as a uh, LP series, you know, just hit that like button. That's all you gotta do. You know? Nothing else. Though comments telling me that you very much want to see a continuation definitely uh, motivates me to upload faster. Uh, our other current series is Dragon's Dogma. So I'm thinking I'm going to upload this alongside it. So you get two Dragon's Dogma and one of these a day. You know, that is if you guys want to see more. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Again, if you liked it, leave a like. And I will see you guys in the next one.